Hello everyone and welcome to a new kind of duel video. I call it the Pack Duel. The idea behind this series is that you can take one or multiple sets from Yu-Gi-Oh! history. This can be a regular set like Abyss Rising, an Astral Pack, a Duelist Pack, a Mega Pack, it doesn't matter. You take one or multiple of these packs, open them a certain amount of times on this pack simulator, uh, de depending on the amount of cards that are in each pack, and then from the cards you pull from those packs, you have to make a deck and then duel with it at least once in the duel video. Now, which pack will I be going for for this video? Well, I asked for suggestions for that six days ago in a duel vlog. And as you can see, we have three of them here. Number one, Ancient Sanctuary. Number two, The Lost Millennium. And number three, Elemental Energy. Now in that order, I'm going to randomly generate a number, and whichever one comes out, we'll be working with that. Let's see. Generate. It is number three. So we are making use of Elemental Energy. Elemental Energy is a pack with nine cards, and that's what most of these are. Uh, nine card packs, and I've decided to open eight of them. If you feel that's too much or too little, just let me know in the comments. I'm also open for suggestions. But for now, we're going to open eight packs of Elemental Energy, and then I have to make a deck with whatever I get. If we get a bunch of duplicates, then, well, I can only use max three of them. Let's see what we get. First pack, Elemental Energy. The middle of persist area, that's nice. 1850 attack. Feather Wind, well, we don't have Avion, so that's not useful. Blade Skater, decent. Oja Muscle, we don't have Ajama, so that's not useful. Chitonian Alliance, could work. We get a super rare, BES Tetron. Not really sure what that does, but I'll look into it in detail off screen, like when I'm not recording when I'm building the deck. Tiger Catapult, well, we could. Well, can, can we use VNW? I'm not entirely sure. Then Wild Heart is a nice card to get. V Tiger Jet, yeah, so V Tiger Jet is in here. So that's a nice first pack. Let's go for number two. Need to remember how many packs I've actually opened. Shonian Polymer could be useful depending on what the opponent uses. Oxygenon, another familiar possessed. The first Dark World, oh yeah, there's a few Dark Worlds in this pack as well. Maybe the first few, I'm not, not, not entirely sure. But we could have a few of those in the deck as well. Gateway, Beige. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is like the first few effect mods. Beige, maybe Bro. I think Gold was in this pack. Alright, let's go for the third pack of Elemental Energy. Ocha Magic, which is going to be a bluff if I use it at all. Familiar Persist Wind, Feather Wind, another Tiger Catapult as a common. A Rarest Arm Changer, Area. No, uh, like, Super Rare or Hollow in this pack, because in this simulator it's always on the 6th spot, which in this case is area, so that, um, yeah, it doesn't really work. Not for this, but I don't mind area, because that has good attack, so... In that sense, it's quite lucky that I got this pack, because there's quite a few parts that are just generic, in a generic deck, are quite good with, like, 1850 attack for the... for your ones. A third VW Tiger Catapult? Can we just get V Tiger Jet and W Wing Catapult, so we can maybe actually use this set card? Area, Oxygenon, nice. <clears throat> Bros. I, I'm looking for some Dark World card and Dark World support. Pretty sure there's at least two or three Dark World support cards in here. See, this is set. This is the f fourth pack? I think I should really keep count somewhere for next time. That's something I need to remember. This could be used with Dark World as well. Not specifically support for it, but that could work. Fifth pack. Infernal Incinerator. I don't think we'll use that, but we'll see. Asa, uh, Dark Deal, Level Modulation. I don't think I have level 1s in this set. Arm Changer again. Depends on how many equip cards there are. I don't think there's that many. Gold is a super rare. That can be really nice um, for the few Dark Worlds that I'll probably put in. Weed Out. Situational, but better to have something that's situational than something I can't use, like OG Muscle. More rocks to get on, another area, so I can probably have three of those. I think in this set, uh, this is now pack six, I'll probably end up having quite a lot of monsters and a few spell and top cards. It's anything generic like Magic Gem or Mirror Force, it's not in the set. So I can't really make use of it. Generally there's spells and traps or like archetype specific or something like that, so not really that work, uh, useful. Jax Knight, Nano Breaker, yeah, it could work, decent stats. We'll have Branch, what is Branch? Mm. 
Okay, yeah, let's say if you use fusions, but not a regular fusion summon. I can do with VW. Seven, Oja Muscle. Uh, it will Cyber Heater. Nice. <clears throat> Don't think I have three of those yet. Gateway to Dark World. That's a nice card I have for some Dark Worlds. Polymer, Beige, and this should be my last pack if I didn't miscount. Nano Breaker, Branch, Simultaneous Loss, another Rollout, King's Knight, Inferno Incinerator, Dark Deal, Feather Wind, and another Beige Vanguard of Dark World. Well, I'm going to have to do it with those uh, 72 cards. I have to build the best deck I can with that. In just a moment, I will show you the deck I've built. I'll build it off screen. I'll show you the deck I've built and then go into the dual video. I hope you're looking forward to it. I'll see you in a few seconds. Just before we uh, get into the duel and I show you the deck, I didn't want to show you this before I actually built the deck. This is supposed to be a behind the scenes thing for the first episode. Um, these are all the cards I put in. If you count together, 63 and 5, 68 cards, not the 72 that I opened. This is because I got four copies of Area, four copies of Beige, four copies of Rollout, and I think Featherwind as well. Featherwind had four copies, so obviously can't enter for them. So, out of these, I have to build a deck. Like, I'll very likely keep the VW Tiger Catapults and then see what I can do for the main deck. Because side deck I'm not going to bother with. So, I'll see you in a moment, and I'll, you'll see the finished deck. Pakudur! Stato! Okay, let's see what we can do. In the sense, I really hope the opponent doesn't have a great deck. So we even stand a chance, because I do want to... Like, I don't need to win any duels with this, but I do want to sort of stand a chance. So I think that for some of these duels for this series, I think I'll just face a friend who I know isn't using as good of a deck. But at the same time, it's interesting to see how I would maybe do against a super good deck. Either way, with the like, trap tricks there and some things there, there's bound to be some trap all stuff. I'm in trouble. Well, yeah, might as well give it a try. I think I'll just do like two or three duel videos per deck. Um, and depending on how the duels go, like I'll, I'll do more or less, and then at the end show the deck profile. I've actually already recorded the deck profile for this, but, I, but I'll actually think I'll re-record it because I want it after the duel. And sure, I could just put the one I already recorded after. I think I'll do that, yeah, for now. There's a few times I say, I am going to duel, while, like, in the video it'll be, I have dueled already, because I'll put it after, but we'll see. Familiar Persist Heater. Bottomless Trap Hole. Yeah, see? That's just probably going to be things like that, and then I just had a chance, because I don't have any excuse mods here either. <laughs> so. Yeah, totally, yeah, because, like, don't give me a chance. Can't special summon monsters, K. Okay, I don't really mind that, so I'll keep him on the field. There's your time space trap hole is there, which is special summon from is it hand or extra back? Just special summon that normal summon? What's this? Because equal to the attacking defense is higher, it's plus 100. Dang it. The sub card is sent from the field of your. Yeah, unfortunately, they're all level 4. Would have been nice otherwise. Um, considering it's going to be destroyed with Patchy Cephalo anyway, I'll go with Oxygetter now instead of Area just to keep those few attack points for later. Because then it may be useful against. Trap tricks with 1800 attack. Yay! I defeated something! Do I get a medal now? Kaisu or Kaiku? I'm gonna have to look that up. I always call him Kaisu. People have been calling him Kaiku, so I'm gonna have to look it up. Yeah. Dang you, Moon Mirror Shield. I was planning to just keep that thing on the field anyway. Okay. Kaisu. I'm gonna just stay to Kaisu because that's what everyone was calling him. At least for this duel. Um, I don't really mind this fact because I don't have any revival things like Call of the Haunted. I do have a revival thing for Dark Worlds, but I've not seen any of my Dark Worlds except Golden now. 
Hey, so here, here's that monster with the 1800 attack that I was referring to, so. Area, let's go. So I can take that out. The Pachycephala will still take me out, even if I attack it. No! Fine, okay! You got it! This one's yours. <laughs> Although, not yet, no. Because I don't have monsters, so they, they don't gain. They deal 3000. I still have a turn. Don't think I can do much there, but I still get a turn. We were able to take one monster in a deck that's known for a bunch of traps like Bottomless Trap Hole and Solemn Morning, so in a sense I'm happy with that. Sure, it's a bit of luck, but I'm happy enough with that. This, like, even though I'm clearly losing, I am finding advantages in the fact that I've got elemental energy as my pack because there's some stuff with good stats, like the familiar persist monsters. So summon target, can't for summon monsters. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to set this so they attack into it and then revive with gateway. Yeah, that looks to be the only way to survive. Oh no! Uh -huh. Nano breaker in defense mode! Cause that thing just no, because Moon Mirror Shield would still be able to beat it, so they'd likely attack with Pachycephalo anyway. Meh. Let's see, come at me. They do that, get a boost in power to 1400, that's a 1700 attack. Here comes the Kaiku. The Kaisu, I already said it. Both ways. What? I, I didn't summon. What? It's a quick play spell. There's a dark world monster in my grave, Vert. Why can't I play it? Target a dark world monster in the grave. I can do that. It's a quick play spell, so I can activate it. You cannot summon other monsters the turn that you activate this card. The only monster I've summoned this turn will be beige. It doesn't say it has to happen during my turn. Does Moon Mirror Shield do something? I don't know. Those are the first monster during damage. Oh, right. Pachycephalo. Of course, Pachycephalo does a lot of special summons. That's it. I failed for a moment there. I forgot about its effect, even though I talked about it at the start of the game when it was summoned. Anyway, um, I think I'll try another duel. Let's hope that one goes better. Okay then. <clears throat> Second try after we get obliterated in the last one. Probably gonna happen here again. I would be very surprised if we win. Or if we get close to winning. Let me know what you guys think, because it's pretty, I suppose, just a test episode to test some things as well. I go through doing one or more packs, because this is a good pack for this series, I'd say. I think good amount of times I want more than one pack, and then. Make section like maybe a worse one, maybe a better one. I haven't really decided on that. Let me know your thoughts on that. Um, but also, what kind of opponents do you want me to face? Just randoms in Death Pro, or do you want me to get a friend like Seb or someone else in for these duels with some with somewhat of a similar deck? So I actually stand a chance to make it more entertaining that way. Just let me know, please. Ooh, both V Tiger Jet and W Wing. I need to have both in the field of a Tiger Catapult. Since the battle position one monster, the opponent's out of the field. I suppose I could give it a shot, summon one of them. Let's keep the others behind for now. Yeah, let's do that. Let's just summon that so I have a chance to play it later. Because otherwise, well, once he gets like his monster and stuff going, I don't expect to even have a chance to summon Tiger Catapult. Could set this for like a possible MST that comes around, but then again, it may actually be useful. May. I would need like like an Oxygeta, like two Oxygeta in two areas. I believe I have a second Nano Breaker as well. So, it is possible that I'll be able to get a taxi. Although, if they do have Mystical Space to food at the time, they, they only use it. When I declare my attack, then I could be in trouble and end up with lower attacking their monster. 
but I'm willing to take the risk. I pretty much need a lot of things to just work out for me to have a chance. Maybe if the opponent just doesn't draw well enough. Won't make that much of an interesting goal, but I suppose I wouldn't mind a victory. Although, that's still, like, interesting duels. Hand destruction. Okay. Oh, there's no rule they select first. And I can even see what they are? Okay. Confident Maxi. Um, at all Cyber Alliance. Actually, in Confit. So, Monarch thing? Level 1 deck? I don't know yet. Something that needs tribute summons? So, I have Confit be a free tribute? Got a few things possible. Let's look at this guy again before they summon anything. This guy won't come from your hand, just better just not. That doesn't look like quick effects, but then again, this was before problem solving card text, I want to say? Yeah, definitely, because it doesn't have any, like, colons or semicolons. Okay, the do have a set monster. I think what I'm going to do, I don't know what they have, but I really just want to use VW. So I'm just going to summon W Wing and summon the other one. Sure, I could equip this to feed Tiger Jet, but that's a boost of 400 points, and then that's what the other guy has as well. And I'm not that afraid of their trap, and even if like, it is dangerous, I just I just need things to work out. With a lot of things that have them not have a good trap and stuff. Aro aro, VW, Tiger Cataparta! Not many times that if we use a single pack, we actually get to summon something from the extra deck. Unless we get something like Generation Force or... I suppose Duelist Alliance would probably be a really good um, deck with the Shadal's Shadal Fusion. That's probably a really strong single pack for this series. Wait, I forgot to use its effect. <clears throat> Hat bonk against this thing that's near my desk. Oh my god, 1900 points. I was thinking about it so much, but then I was sit talking about Duelist Alliance, like thinking about that, and then I lost my thought. This is why I don't do commentary in official tournament duels. Sure, I wouldn't use a deck like this, but then I start, even though I had the idea to switch the thing to attack mode, I just think about something else just to make the commentary interesting, and I forget about something. Sometimes. Won't always happen, but sometimes. Which is unfortunate. It doesn't say during either player's story or anything like it. So I it I don't believe it's a quick effect. If I get the option to use it, sure. The lose connection, really? They're never gonna try. I wasn't gonna be able to take them out next turn, maybe in two turns if they had a really sucky hand. But I suppose to keep this in, yay, we get to summon VW Tiger Catapult. And we won, even though I don't feel too great about it. I'll play one more duel. I'll see how that goes, and uh, that'll be it for the first episode. See you in the next one. Fighter! Let's have this final deciding duel to see if we'll go two wins or two losses out of three matches. And then I'll show you the deck that I built out of the 72 cards I got at the start. Um... W wing, let's get a. We already went with VW. I don't think it'll be that useful. I, d I don't think I'll be able to get it out again. And if I can, chances are I'd he they just need to not destroy this and they need to draw into Tiger really quickly. Like next turn. Do even have a chance to use it. What's that? Oh, a bunch of new Dark Magician stuff, okay. Okay. I have, don't remember, ever seeing this card. I've seen a good amount of things. Magician of Dark Illusions, Magician's Robe, things like that. But, nope. Not yet. Let's see. That might be a trap. So, Elemental Hero Wild Heart! I'm about to just activate the next Dark Magic Circle next turn, but yeah. Let's 
go and actually attack and do stuff. And deal as much damage as we can while we can. They have a mirror force, because otherwise they would not do that. If they had magic cylinder that they wanted to use, they would have just used it in a catapult or saved it. They have something like mirror force or drowning mirror force to do. So I'm actually not going to attack so I can save Wildheart next turn. I think. Because otherwise I'm just going to lose both of my monsters. I think with them having used Valor... This is better. It might have been a bluff, though. If this was a bluff, then props to them. I got the second Dark Magic Circle, as expected. Let's see what they add. Like, they'll get two of the same options from before. Dark Magic Succession. Another Searcher. They don't have any spells in the grave, because these things are continuous. So I got Twin Twisters, destroying their own stuff. I wouldn't mind that. I would not mind that. And let's turn again. I'm thinking whether I should just summon gold. Because then I can actually bring it back with gateway. The only way I would keep it if if I want to use Dark Doors and freely special summon it. But that's if I get it, so I think I'll just might as well use it now. And keep the other mods that I'll normal summon on, like for when he um doesn't have mirror force anymore. And maybe has monsters, because Although maybe, like, not. I was gonna say, maybe if I had a monster and I kept gold, I would tribute Wildheart. But if he has a monster, he can probably take out Wildheart. So let's do some butter! Wildheart! Direct attacker! Let's see what you have. Mirror Force? Okay. Burying Mirror Force. Pretty sure that's not the official name. Like in TCG. So... It would have, I suppose, been better to attack last turn. Because I would have just been in defense and I would have had three attacks this turn. Yeah. I, that, that, it's still understandable, I feel that. I feel it was still a safe decision to not use it. But knowing, if I would have known it was this card, I would have just attacked. Because that. They wouldn't have taken damage anyway, and I would have had more defense as well. Apprentice Illusion Magician. Um, okay. Like, the monster can do 2,000 attack adventure and damage calculation only. Oh, yeah. Retrained thing. Oh, another one. Great, here comes the X Seizing, or. No, they just add another Dark Magician, because they just can. Ooh, fancy looking new one. Wow. Yeah, there is Wildheart. What's that snow with you, bro? Let's see, in the optimal world, I would have used my... I would have attacked last turn, then I would have used the card, then I would have normal summoned the Gehita this turn, or last turn, or win. I would have had three monsters, they would just have two monsters on the field right now. Take out two, I would have had one left, then I could tribute it for gold and take some one of their stuff out. Optimally knowing what they have right now. However, they also have that. Although, I don't expect to really use a lot of the guide work. Or that. I didn't. Yeah, I didn't remember I could do that. They can. Here comes the Dark Magician. I'm gonna assume a third one from the deck, and then Dark Magic Circle to banish my f gold. Yeah, Dark Magic from the deck. Dark Magic Circle go. Wild Heart? Huh, saves me a thousand life points, I won't complain. Oh, no, that it really matters, because even Illusion Magician has another effect that they can use. Like when Dark Magician attacks, they can Spanish it. Why do they use Black Lesser Soldier's effect? 
They can just attack with Dark Magician, use Ebon's effect to banish it, replay, attack directly, attack directly, attack directly. They had an OTK. Maybe they didn't realize part of the effect as well. I'm just now reading them, or supposed to reading them again, because I did sort of remember what they did. They had an OTK on the field. They didn't do it, because now BLS can't attack. Not that I'll be surviving next turn at all, because like I don't have anything to take out BLS. So even if like I they use their effect on my stuff, they still direct attack directly with stuff. And even if I take out BLS, they still have Ebon Illusion Magician's effect if the Dark Magician attacks. Even and if they summon another Dark Magician, which is very well possible, it's called using Ebon Illusion Magician's effect and summoning the Dark Magician. I know they have in their hand. Let's see, you can only use this effect of Ebon Illusion Magician. Yeah, not both. Like, one effect per turn. They can use both effects once, like, at least once per turn. I'll just set a monster because I can, because there's not anything else happening. I do want to see this play out. Uh, meanwhile, I'll ask you, what do you think of this idea uh, of a new series, this pack duel? Do you like it? Is it too long of a video? Uh, if you have any suggestions to improve it, whether it's length, the way I go about using the packs, anything, just let me know. I'm definitely looking for suggestions, seeing how things can work out. Because I want to make this a cool and really interesting series. Let me know what you would like to see from it. And meanwhile, give some suggestions, please, in the comments. I'll allow you to put, let's say, two suggestions per person for packs. Um to use in the next video, because probably next video I'm going to do two packs and see how that goes, how that feels. Oh no, I'm going to get killed now by even a new monster, Sorcerer of Dark Magic, just because they could. I will see you on the deck profile, and then see you later in the next Yu-Gi-Oh! video. Goodbye. Okay then, this is the deck that I'll be using. I suppose it's sort of a deck profile. Um, I mostly got rid of cards that I just wasn't able to use at all, such as Oja Magic, Oja Muscle, Hero Berry, and need an Elemental Hero, which I didn't have. So, a good amount of useless cards that way, level modulation as well, I just got rid of because they just were not usable except for Bluff to just set them. There's some cards like Weed Out and Chithonian Polymer that I don't expect to use a lot, that are quite situational, but it's better to have something that's situational than something that can't be used at all, except for bluffing, because the bluffing deck Polymer can do as well. Um, I kept, I believe, all of my mods except Inferno Incinerator. Got rid of that, because I didn't intend to use that without the effect. Jack's Knight, Reserve, V Tiger Jet. I have one V Tiger Jet and one W Wing Catapult, so I may be able to get the, the Tiger Catapult off. We'll see. Two blade skaters kept Tetron because it's actually quite a nice effect. We'll see if I can actually tribute summon it at any point. Gold, two heaters, one win. Hopefully, I'll add a second win if I win the duel. <laughs> um, one Osa, three areas, three Oxygenons. We have two Nano Breakers, a King's Knight. Unfortunately, no Queen's Knight, so I can't do King's Knight, Queen's Knight, and Jack's Knight. Three beige, Wild Heart, Catapult, Natural Cyber, Born Zombie, Bro, Scar. Some Dark World support here, and in a sense, also with Dark Deal here. Chitonian Alliance, which could work because I have some months with similar names, and Arm Change, or just with Alliance and themselves to hopefully do something. I have Weed Out, and then Polymer, and then, like, I suppose Polymer's in the side deck, although I wouldn't use it. And Simultaneous Loss, probably wouldn't use that as well, but I didn't want to keep it because it is a situational card and it's not useless. So, I'm going to be using this. Let's duel!